G'day guys, Papa Phoenix here, and today I'm doing an unboxing of the brand spanking new Loewe t-shirt from their Divine collaboration. As part of Pride Month, Loewe got on the bandwagon by teaming up with the magnificent devil of drag, Divine. For those who haven't heard of Divine, she was a cult icon from the 70s, 80s, famous mostly starring in John Waters productions like Hairspray, Female Trouble, and notoriously Pink Flamingos. Yes, she was the person eating dog shit. Honestly, I was so psyched for this collection to happen. I've been a fan of Divine for so long. I still remember the first time I watched Pink Flamingos. Every single minute of that film, my eyes were glued to the screen. And after watching, I couldn't tell if I'd just watched the trashiest dumpster fire of a film or if I just saw a poetic masterpiece. I actually still feel the same way about this film 10 years later. But let's not forget the clothing itself. I mean, the way they have been hitting some massive home runs with Jonathan Anderson at its forefront. But conversely, I actually think that Lueve has been a massive help to Jonathan Anderson's style, actually giving him a, the chance to work in a subtlety that he, to be honest, previously avoided. By muting his distinctive color palettes and pushing him to work within the constraints of the iconic house's style, he's finally been given the chance to work with these incredible unique textures and shapes, which I personally think resulted in his most sophisticated show yet with his Fall Winter 2020 Lueve collection. But getting back to the collection, it was actually very unfortunate that due to COVID, there was a limited variety in their production. If I'm correct, the original capsules were meant to encompass around 15 pieces, you know, including dresses, shoes, a couple more bags, a couple more t-shirts. But unfortunately, in the ready to wear, there was actually only four pieces released. Nevertheless, I picked up one of the filthiest person in a live black t-shirts. Um, it was so funny looking at Instagram when this shirt first came up. Because unless you're a filthy bastard and no pink flamingos like I do, you're not going to get this reference. Every comment was like, why the fuck would you print this on a t-shirt? That's a good question to be honest though. Why would you? Well, obviously for freaks like me. So thank you very much, Jonathan Anderson. Thank you very much, Lueve. And thank you very much, Divine. Now let's open this son of a bitch. Okay, so I've just opened the flaps now. Let's look. Oh, that's cool. That's cool. So it's kind of like a roll within itself. So um, let's let's go. Let's go. Ooh, very nice, very nice. Oh, very cool. Okay, cool. Okay, so this is what we've got. So we've got the Lueve Love Divine. Made in Portugal, very beautiful. We've got the Lueve embroidery there. Tag, little Lueve tag holder, what's there? Beautiful. Richard Bernstein, yeah, awesome. Filth black, awesome. Okay, cool, so we've got the Lueve card. And is there anything in there? Thank you for your purchase, uh, and just receipt. And let's take this off. Now, first thing I noticed is like, on the internet, it looked, um, it didn't look like as good a quality print, but this is actually really cool. The detail and the colors are just legendary. And like the, um, it actually, it just looks really, really cool. I don't know if that comes across, um, but like the contrast in the, um, and the newspaper print looks awesome, absolutely awesome. And then just flipped around it, it's just a black t-shirt with the Lueve embroidery. That's awesome, look at that, fuck yeah. That's a really nice collar as well. So that's the t-shirt. I am super happy with it. The print is awesome. Like the detail in the print is legendary. I dig it. The cut is awesome. I'm digging this super, super oversized. It's kind of like, it uh, feels like a uh, Heron Preston kind of oversizing. Very, very nice. It's gonna work so well with so much. I'm stoked. Peace out, guys.